Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Necro Pop Digital. Yeah, yeah. So today, this is going to be a really short video, but I noticed that a lot of the VST plugins hosts do not allow for startup. Like you can't, it won't automatically start up for with Windows. So what I'm going to do is show you today how to do that so that it uh, starts up with Windows every time. Because, you know, you, of course, you know, playing right when I start the video pisses me off. But at any rate, this will be a very quick video on how to do that. All right. So let's get this out of the way first. I will select my design. Okay, yeah, check out that awesome wallpaper. So we're going to hit the start, start button, right? First of all, before you do that, well, no, it doesn't matter. Just go to the start button and hit run. If you can't find run, then just type run into the start menu and it's right there. Just click it and you'll see shell or you type in shell colon startup hit okay and it's going to bring you to a folder and that's what the folder looks like as you can see it's right here wherever you have lighthost or any one of those programs you will like for for me it's in a completely different thing okay You'll right click. I'll use voice meter as a uh, a benchmark here. Uh, you you'll right click, create shortcut. Okay, it'll put it in the same folder that the pro the program's in, the host is in. And then you just copy it and paste it into this startup folder, and that's it. Uh, in addition to that, you can also just drag it and drop it in this the shortcut once that's done you can close that out and you're done technically now if you want to make sure that lighthost always shows up in your system tray or your sys tray go into taskbar settings whoop wrong one i hate it when i do that go to taskbar settings scroll to where it says select which icons to appear on taskbar and it should appear this is how you know it'll it'll actually work okay select it to on and you're done so doing that will allow it to it'll start up with windows every time i've already tested it it works great on windows 10 so yeah um if you do have any sort of a problem go ahead and go back to main here if you do have any sort of uh, problem where it won't start up for whatever reason you can go into the start either the the exe and right click the exe so let's go to go into my folders i'll, I'll let you see it in just a second here i just want to make sure i'm actually doing this correctly okay so what you'll do is you'll go to the shortcut or the exe you'll probably want to do both of them you right click hit properties go into compatibility and right here it says run this program as an, an administrator select it or tick it on whatever hit ok or uh, and apply and you're done do the same for the shortcut in the start menu properties compatibility click and hit apply okay and you should be done um, most of the times it should work without having to do that but in the event that you do have these problems you might have to so just wanted to make you aware of that um, and one last thing that I wanted to mention is in voice meter itself. I'll go ahead and drag this over here. 
so you can see it. Put it in design here. Um, one thing to note, a lot of us have multiple microphones, right? For whatever reason, at least on my setup, the plugins would not work with voice meter until I selected my toner mic. That's the one that I'm speaking into now, uh, was selected in the first input. If you're having problems with it, then try that because originally I had it set to the third input and it just did not want to work for whatever reason. I don't know. But when I put it into input one and I, I did it just to test, just to see, and it worked. So check your inputs to make sure that your whichever mic you use as a primary is working because that's how I got it to work. Anyway, I hope that this video was helpful and I hope that everything works out. Let me know how it goes for you guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you found the video helpful, do me a favor, hit the like button. Uh, I'm trying something new. So if you like the content itself, drop a sub and yeah. Anyway, that's it. Y'all take care, stay safe, and I'll see you on the flip side. Peace.